So we've created, well, we've created one point, drew it, changed it, drew it, changed it, drew it. Let's do something slightly different. Let's create a bunch of points and then draw a bunch of points. So how do you create a bunch of points? Well, if you're going to create three or four, you can just make point, you know, P1, P2, P3, P4, but I don't know how many I want. What we're going to do is use an array. Call it points. New point. Let's do an int. Size equals 10. Okay, so this will create an array of points. Now, any time that uh, you create an array, it creates a default value. What's the default value of, of a point or any mutable object will be null. What we have to do is run through this array and create a new point at each position in there. So we're gonna go for int i equals zero. I less than points dot length with the tab key there uh, plus plus I. So this will loop through the entire array. Now I get to decide uh, what I want to put in there. So we're going to go points at position I equals new point. I didn't have a choice on that, uh, but I can choose what coordinates I put in here. Uh, and I can use the i variable. So I'm gonna, I get an x and a y vari uh, value. So let's do 10 plus uh, 20 times i comma 10. Uh, now, wouldn't it be nice to uh, draw all these? So I'm going to draw them in a separate for loop. So instead of making new points, what we're going to do is draw points i. Okay, so we should make a bunch of points, then draw a bunch of points, and let's not draw p anymore. I don't really care much about that one point p. All right, so this says it's running right here, and I didn't see anything happen. Oh, it was running for four minutes and 50 seconds. Ah. What probably happened is that graphics window was open in the background and I didn't notice. Uh, so there's, that's, that's what I was expecting to see. What just occurred is I just ignored that graphics window. I never closed it and it's a little bit uh, hard to see, but it says running down here. And if you don't notice that, things can act like everything's normal and then you go to hit the run button and you realize that it's grayed out. What's happening, you left a graphics panel open, which you can either close with X or hit the stop button. Doesn't matter. So make sure you close that graphics window down. So there we go, a bunch of points there. Let's uh, make them go all the way over to the edge. So I want int width equals 500. Don't need P anymore. Let's make 25. I may or may not use the width and height. I may have made tw too many. Let's do 22. Just doing some guess and check here. All right, 24. Perfect, that works for me. Okay, so let's, now what I would like to do is be able to draw lots of points at one time. So I just duplicated the uh, line right there. And what I'm gonna do inside here, nope, not that, this. There's a few things it's complaining about. Uh, they, these two methods are both called draw and they both accept a point as the uh, parameter, but you can, you're not allowed to do that. But this one, what I want to do is print lots of points. So I just add that in and that says an array of points. 
So we created the points here. And we're going to draw points. Should do the exact same thing. There we go. I'm going to do this a second time. Now let's not get too crazy. This is probably good enough for now. 